FBI agents and police officers have swarmed the family home of Brian Laundry as part of their investigation into the disappearance of his girlfriend Gabby Petito. They believe they have found her remains yesterday in Wyoming. Laundry returned home from the couple's cross country trip alone and now he has gone missing. ABC's Rena Roy has the latest on this investigation. A devastating update to a desperate search. Authorities believe human remains found near Grand Teton National Park are consistent with the description of 22-year-old Gabby Petito. Full forensic identification has not been completed to confirm 100% that we found Gabby, but her family has been notified of this discovery. Gabby's boyfriend, 23-year-old Brian Laundrie, is a person of interest in the case after returning home to Florida from their cross-country road trip with her van, but without her. Police frantically searching for him since Friday when his parents revealed they last saw him on Tuesday. A swarm of FBI agents closing in on their Northport, Florida home this morning, taking his parents into a van before allowing them back inside the house. Brian and Gabby were last seen together August 24th, leaving a hotel in Utah. Petito telling her mother over the phone the next day they were on the way to Grand Teton National Park, where that grim discovery was made on Sunday. Laundry's sister Cassie is sharing a statement exclusively with ABC News, sharing condolences and prayers with Petito's family, adding Gabby was a fun and loving influence to the boys, as she always referred to them. We will cherish all the time spent with her. She shared these postcards she received from Petito during the road trip, many of them addressed to her boyfriend's nephews and signed Aunt Gabby. One reading, Uncle Brian and I miss you so much. Everywhere we go reminds us of you. One of the last text messages she got from Gabby reads, I can't believe school started already, adding, send me a picture of the boys to show Brian. We're in arches right now, so we don't have the best Wi-Fi. Northport police say they've called off the extensive search in the swampy nature reserve near Laundry's home where they'd been looking for him for days. They believe they've exhausted all avenues there, but they are still continuing their overall search for him. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.